going on guys welcome back it is thursday april 9th devin and i are getting ready to load up and drive to lake texoma we're going to be fishing for some striper off the new bona fide kayaks today it's going to be the first time you have seen both of these out on the water at the same time at the same time we got some coffee going we got a fresh pot of coffee this morning and i've got uh, two of the gopros ready today we're using a six and an eight we also have uh some portable battery chargers that I bring these battery whoop my charge battery packs I bring these my charge portable battery packs with us in case we need to charge more GoPro batteries while we're out but we just picked up a lot more so we have like plenty of GoPro batteries we should be just fine and uh, yeah we're gonna go try and get on some huge fish this morning it should be a bunch of fun so come along with us you guys we're gonna go ahead like I said load up and get on the road some shad colorations out here. I had rigged this up last night with a bunch of stuff for Striper. Let me get this garage door open and we can uh, load this truck up. Okay, put this tackle up and grab the backpack. All right, let's get the show on the road. You guys have a great night. You, you too. too. Appreciate you. Chicken biscuit, hash browns, sausage, egg and cheese. Trailer fits. All right guys, about eight o'clock in the morning and we have made it down to Lake Texoma, or up, I should say. We're about to uh, <laughs> cruise through this narrow passageway through the woods here and there's a spot for us to drop our kayaks and we're actually here with our friend Travis. He is going to be showing us his usual honey holes that he hits on his yak. And so we are all just gonna get out and have a bunch of fun. You guys, let's go ahead and get down to the water. All right guys, here we go. Got the goodies. Devin's maiden voyage on the new Bonafide. All right, officially good to go. We are out here. Travis got his little pup over here. Quarantine and unemployment at its finest. All right guys, we're at the first spot. We're gonna cast a few lines. Right off that little island right there. See if we can't snatch us a few cruising, let the wind take us down and fish along this rock here. See what happens. First few casts going with the chatterbait. I thought I was gonna get one out there. Are you, oh, there we go. Oh no, he came off. Wait, he came off, dang. First bite, first bite. <laughs> he was on there for a second. Did you see the? Did you see the rod tip shaking too? Okay. Oh, right at the bear. <laughs> first catch of the day. Gee whiz. There we go, guys. First catch of the day. Right at the yak. We're gonna let him go. Taking right off. He smacked it right at the boat, man. That was pretty cool. <laughs> I didn't know what I had. I saw a big old white flash. Turns out it wasn't that big at all. But first fish of the day, what time is it? It is now 9.40 this morning. Just hitting a lot of these wind-blown uh, islands here. Travis has worked his way to the other side of this deal. Devin is just hanging out <laughs> against some brush here. <laughs> all right, let's go. Something just jumped right here. something oh another little guy you're okay you're okay you're okay you're okay hold on hold on what got happened? a couple little pictures let's get him on his way <laughs> oh dang guys i messed up i was not recording for my first striper catch he hit maybe 15 feet out from the boat and got them pretty dang good. Here we go guys, just what we came here for. Caught the first striper. This guy's probably 
you know, pounding three quarters to two pounds. Dang, and he's got some fight in him, I'm telling you what. But we want to try and get some that are even bigger. And uh, I think we, with the sun popping out, maybe now they're going to start feeding. So let's see what happens if that did change anything and they are going to start hitting. We're just throwing shad colored crankbaits out here. And it's what we've been throwing the last few hours or a couple hours. But uh, you know, you really got to, we we're not using any electronics. So it's tough to find these fish. We're just kind of casting on a whim anywhere we see fit. And we finally caught the first striper of the day, guys. Sweet, man. Let's get this thing back in the water real quick. Things. They're ferocious. All right. Oh, I had something. Oh, I've still got him. Got something. I think he's swimming towards me. I don't feel too much weight. There he goes. Oh, it's one of those little guys. This is a hybrid or a white bass. We'll just let you go quick release style. Let's see ya. We're hunting for the striper, man. Hunting for the striper. I thought that too. Oh, got some. There we go. Yep. I don't think it is. Oh, no, it is. There we go. You got this one on film. That's what I'm talking about. Come on up here. Come on up here. <laughs> Sweet. Yeah, it is. This is the Carl's Golden Boy crank, by the way, guys. I think it's like a three to five foot diver. It's got a little rattle. And uh, just any shad colored crank would probably do the trick out here. Devin's throwing a lipless. Woo -hoo -hoo! That's the way to do it. There we go. This is a, this one, this one might be smaller. This is smaller than that first one I caught by a little bit. <laughs> he said, oh, we got him. Oh, we got him. <laughs> All right, we're going to let him go. <laughs> there goes number two. <laughs> All right, we are stationed by the secret tree. See if we can't get something over here in a new area. Low wind. We were hitting that one blown bank over there. We have switched, made a move to the opposite side here. Do I have something? If I do, it's small. I don't think so. But my crankbait's not reeling anymore. I thought I felt some head shakes. Oh, I do. <laughs> I kept that quiet. I didn't think I had a fish, but I felt like a little bit of a head shake. And uh, yeah, check him out, man. He's munching. He was going after that little golden boy. Back in the water. Peace. Let's try that again. They might be schooled up out here. It might be onto something over here in this little corner. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I think that's a striper. Just a little guy. I don't know what's going on. I don't know. Yeah, we probably should go ahead and hit the other cove then. All right, we're going to make a little move, guys. I'm seven fish in, and I don't think Travis or Devin has caught a fish yet. <laughs> Come on, kayak. I found myself on an island. Just got the kayak up on land for a half a second. Oh, walk it out a little bit, man. We've been sitting for a while. Check this little thing out. Wonder if there's any fish in here. I'm gonna give it a glance. It's like super clear when you compare it to the rest of this place. 
Might have to throw a little crawl in here or something. Yep, don't see much in there. Well, we're gonna hit some more windblown banks over here. Devin is still on the hunt for her first catch, and we're catching everything today on the Carl's Amazing Baits Golden Boys so far. Rocking the bona fide yaks. The first time she's taken her aqua color out, it's called Endless Summer. And then we are rocking the Venom color. Brand new colors for 2020 on the bona fide SS 127 yaks, you guys. Okay, I think I'm about ready to load back up and uh, cast another line. Well, 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 this spot just looks too good to pass up. I don't know if I would catch a striper here or a largemouth. Looks like largemouth territory. Picking up some grass for the first time today. At least we knocked that awesome looking spot off the list. Well, we're on our way back to the bank, guys, after hitting some awesome looking spots, and I just saw a big old fishy breach of the surface right here. So I want to take a couple more casts. This yak is super stable, by the way. The uh, winds have really picked up out here in the open water. And you can see the waves be going crazy, Jack. <laughs> Devin's powering through. Thought I'd give that an extra second or two, but I am losing all my progress I'm making in these high winds <laughs> while my paddling. Let me go ahead and uh, catch up with you guys at the truck here in just a second. All right, we have beat Devin to the bank. I'm gonna try and uh, get a little bit of this unloaded. That way I can help her as soon as she gets here. We'll carry these yaks up to the truck. And uh, yeah, let me get all this done. I'll catch y'all in a second. it up good to go all right give us a second we're gonna get out of here guys and then we'll uh, holler at you at the house all right guys we are back at the casa and i just want to wrap things up by saying the absolute golden ticket today was the carl's baits golden boy that thing really took care of business caught every one of the fish despite travis and devin not catching anything having some bad luck and now i just changed a little bit and i'm getting ready to head out again i'm gonna hit an evening session with you we're gonna go try and catch some big pond largemouth if you're into that and new to the channel don't be afraid to subscribe you don't have to but uh, maybe just drop a like or something and we'll catch you all on the next video hope to see you on these largemouth episodes peace out y'all <gasps>